Well, hello, my friends, and welcome back to another Saturday Fly With Me. My name is Cody, or Lufthansa 145, and you are aboard Austrian Flight 281. We're back in the Embraer 195. Yes, I do like to do myself self-harm. Uh, and we're on the uh, pro trait now into Leipzig from Vienna. Uh, 26 left is what we're set up for. Near one whiskey arrival here at Leipzig. Um, I don't know what it is about this airplane. It doesn't really like me. Every time I'm about to like launch into um, uh, into the, the descent, I put on VNAV for whatever reason, and the thing just like does a flat line down to what it's supposed to be, and then tries to do a minus 8,000. So uh, that's why I'm in uh, managed descent right now. It uh, descends about 1,500 or uh, later. Actually, we're gonna crank that up a bit because I am watching this line here so I want to try and be about 5,000 above there. Uh, slowing down right now for the descent through um, flight level uh, 10,000 feet. So I hope everyone's good. I've been good. It's been a shit night though for trying to do flights so uh, let me just adjust my mic because I see that's hot. I was attempting to do um, turn lights I was attempting to try and fit two flights in here tonight the first of which being um, uh, a full flight and what I was trying to do for the full flight was um, to set up uh, the um, well first I was gonna do an Airbus I, I've been really stoked about our new airline Sun Express it has brought a lot of brand new faces to the airline and I'm very very excited about that uh, so I was like all right I did a 737 two weeks ago for the first Sun Express flight. I then did a 737 uh, for my last full flight or fly with me video uh, to retire ABBJ, which I'm still very bummed about. Um, and then I was like, all right, well, <laughs> I can't do 737s anymore. I think we're starting to run that one into the ground. So I was like, maybe we'll do a Sun Express Airbus. And then I couldn't within about like the 30 minutes, I tried looking for either an FS Labs variant or. Um, Sadly enough, I did end up finding a, um, a uh, Aerosoft Airbus version, but I was like, uh, I don't know if I can do that to myself. But it was the only one I had, and I tried installing it, and it didn't work. It was meant for the older version, not the Aerosoft Professional. So, sigh. So, long story short, I was like, that's not going to work. All right, let's do full flight. We'll take the Dash 8 from um, Manchester to uh, Dusseldorf. Go to set that up, get into the program there, and the weight and balance calculator would not work for the life of me. So I was like, well, this is not turning out to be my night. So here we are. I decided, why don't we do uh, your rate? Full flight, SSG Embraer, and we'll go into Leipzig. So I wanted to do an Austrian flight, so that's what we are presenting you now. So. Let's get our heads back into here. We're through 8,000. Let's set the Q and H, which I did not look up really quickly. So that looks in here. Q and H at like the show information says. Uh, winds are 200 at six knots. Niner, 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 niner. Q and H 999. Wow, all right. Nine nine nine. Let's get our minimum set to two hundred radio alt. Let's get in the hair. And let's go. Airplane missed. That. that was quite a tight turn that we did there. I want to try and get three thousand here, so I'm gonna make that green dot mate with that blue dot at the right spot. Cool. I know there's a 5,000 restriction. I'm going to go through it. It's fine. Uh, we're online at the Vetsons right now. Uh, so this is probably one of the maybe last two flights I'm going to do on Vatsim old audio codec. I'm, uh, I'm sad. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, there's no one here to talk to, so there's no real thing to be sad about. But uh, yeah, so that's VOR2. What's the radio doing right now? Have you picked up the... 110.30 is what it's going to be when it actually clicks in. 
there's someone on the tea cast right there, but there's no one there. So that's a false reading. I guess it's going to be an in sim kind of guy. Uh, Johnny says I'm hurting myself again. LOL. Uh, by flying this airplane, I know. This airplane and I, we try. I really, really try. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. What can we do? Let's do seatbelt and sterile cockpits. Everything else up there is looking a-okay. Airplane's lining back up. Well, I don't like some of these lines here. I'm hoping I'm headed to Lisba. Flight plan. Lisba DP402 to core. What's this? Uh, I'm gonna hope they got this thing smart enough to go and not blow through that. We'll use this opportunity to wind the speed back a bit. And have a look see outside. Interesting day here. A little hazy. German countryside, it's looking very, very nice as normal. There's another guy over there, minus 41. Am I going over like an airport that maybe that's ground traffic? No? Interesting. It's gotta be sim stuff. And we're losing our biz. That's okay. So radio, waiting for that 11030 to click in onto one of the sides. Coming up on that 5,000 limit, but let's, we'll let it go through. You know, we uh, well, we still got a bit to go. I'm just gonna start winding back my speed, but no, we'll keep high speed here, so that way we can get into the approach. We're still about. What's the there? About 25 nautical miles to go. I think once we get to Lisba and DP402, we'll start putting out the six levels of flap in this thing. Oh, I don't know how people fly these things IRL, but like just the yoke itself is very peculiar to me. Well, let's take that out for this one. I never ever fly with the yoke on. Autopilot disconnects. Doesn't look like that button works, so we'll just. Uh, now I heard that sucker click. Lock two IS LSL one ten thirty. So let's put on. Even though we're far away, but we'll put on localizer mode if I can find it. No, this sucker only has approach, doesn't it? All right, very well. Approach mode. And we will wait for the localizer to come. Flying back our speed to flat one, so we'll go to 25. Been in the air 46 minutes now. It's a very quick, almost hour long flight from uh, Leipzig. And do I have a good wing view that we can look at? Well, I guess not enough for the flaps at least. Oh, localizer's coming. Localizer's coming, airplane is detecting. Speed check, flaps one, 1,000 to level. And zoom in on our map. Yeah, that's why I want to get the flaps out because it likes to stall out and actually start climbing the airplane. Take our speed back to 200 now. Which will allow me to do flaps two. Localizer's there, localizer's coming. Very important note. Virtual LH, virtual 
I guess we should be virtual LG, but that's uh, probably draw a lot of notice from the uh, television manufacturer, LG television behind me. Okay, airplane, why are you trying to climb? Stop trying to climb. This down. Going down to three. Please and thank you. I did not tell you to climb. So exciting things. Uh, started this week, Tuesday. I love to cater all of my new people. A lot of new people came for Sun Express. There is now a Sun Express tour. Uh, and I show it really quickly while we wait. VirtualH.com. Of course, I'm not logged in. Operations tours. So its aerological tour continues. Uh, it's been expanded to some um, January 12th. Uh, Hello Sun Express is the latest tour. So uh, you can do it in 737, A320, or both. Totally up to you. Uh, you start at Anatalia and you end up back at Anatalia. So really interesting tour. I strongly encourage you to check it out, uh, if you will. And let's take flaps three and reduce speed to 190. And localizer glide slope. And let's take, after I do this, the gear. Wow, look at that nose down attitude. Brutal. Uh, let's do, uh, we can't do flaps four yet. We gotta go back to 180. Let's actually go down to 170. Flaps four. Why is that not working? Okay, I'm trying to arm the spoilers. Well, that's not working. All right, whatever. We'll just yank those suckers out by hand. Flaps five. Uh, maybe I can't do that until flaps full. Yeah, it is three, four. Weird. Okay, runway's in sight. Let's dial back final speed. 130 flaps full runway in sight let us allow the speed to dial back lights are fully on passengers are down flaps full now we let me go to spoiler interesting that thing don't like me right now Okay, there's 130, engines are spooling back up. We'll take out the automatic speed in a second. Once she stabilizes. Oh wow. He's messaging me like mad, even though I'm like, hey, I'm landing right now. I'll be back soon someday. Yeah, our boy Johnny. Got to be very proud of him. He took time off to get a job, and then he got himself an amazing job. So, uh, job well done for him, that's for sure. Okay. Hopefully we get some sounds here. I feel like we're incredibly high. and offline, but. 1,000. 1,000 call outs. Let's take. Autopilot. Autopilot. I have control. Kinda. Why 
experience it that with every airplane that I fly, the moment that I take control, it starts to dive every single time. I'm starting to believe some of these people that absolutely have something against the frickin' SciTech Pro Flight System, because I can't win with it. Now I'm offline. 500. I'm fucking pulling back on the stick like crazy. Concentrate. Concentrate. Now we're too high. And now she won't go down because this thing sucks Minimum. more. Trim. Wow. Garbage. 100. 50. 40. 30. 20. 10. I'll take it. Reverse manual spoilers. Transponder set to standby. Transponder apparently got set to standby. I think that is a Lua plugin I gotta get rid of. Spoilers. Oh, we forgot something on our landing checklist. Which we didn't use. And why am I rolling off the runway to the left? What the hell? Oh my god. I hate you. Alright, let's vacate to the left. <laughs> the ever going saga of Cody. One day he'll get played right. One day. Just not today. Okay, I got an incredibly long taxi. I'm actually gonna go out along back to the end of the runway, back across into the terminal, which is well over there. Uh, so I'm not gonna take you for that. I hope you enjoyed that landing. So yeah, like I said, we have the Interological Tour happening right now. We now have the Hello Sun Express Tour. Lots of new people flying. You can totally fly too. VirtualLH.com is where you go to sign up. It's very easy. Um, I am almost through creating what would be the most amazing how-to for that to give everybody a really good op opportunity to know uh, how to use our website, how to use the ACARS, and how it all kind of meshes together. Uh, for the existing pilots, the new code of conduct is coming soon. Uh, not much different than the old code of conduct, a little bit more lenient than uh, what we had before. So hope everybody will enjoy that. So like I said, we're going to go park up. I will, like always, give you the lovely views of the airplane parked at the gate. Thanks so much for joining me. Stay safe, happy flying, and hopefully my full flights video will premiere tomorrow. Whatever it'll be, I don't know because I can't seem to get it out. So we'll see you soon. Cheers.